Hi, welcome. Simon here, and I hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll walk you through step by step on how to do a speaker replacement on both sides, left and right. So on my laptop, I do have a muffle sound. When you hear like the static or muffle sound coming off from your speaker, that means that speaker needs to be replaced. The plastic is broken. Um, therefore, I like to make this video and show you step by step on how to do that. So let me identify the laptop. This is MacBook Pro 13 inch. Flip it around. The model here, if you take a closer look, is A1502. Uh, A1502. And this is a 2015 model. If you have the 2014 model, you can follow along with the video. I believe, don't don't quote me on this i might be wrong 2013 is the same model as this 2014 and 2015 i know for sure you can follow along the video all right so let's go ahead and get started the first thing you need to have is your pantaloupe screwdriver and this is pantaloupe p5 let's go ahead and remove all the screws we need to get the back cover removed If you're not sure where to buy the tools from, or maybe not sure where to buy the replacement speaker, what I'll do is I'll link them in the description below. If you go check it out, it'll direct you to either Amazon or eBay, where you can buy the replacement parts and the tools. Once you have removed all the screws, you can simply just remove the entire back cover here by simply pop it up. You do need to put some pressure because these both sides right here in the back, they are clipped onto the computer. So you need to pop it right up. All right. So here you pretty much can see the, uh, the entire computer. So it's quite dirty. But in this video, we are not cleaning the computer. I'm showing you how to do a speaker replacement. The next step I like to do is to go ahead and disconnect the battery. You want to open up the plastic cover. The connector of the battery, they're just like Lego. They snap on top of it and push in to install. To remove, you just simply lift it straight up. Once the battery is disconnected, you can identify this is your left speaker and this is your right speaker or the other way around when you look at the, if you flip it around. Okay, so the next step I like to do is to get underneath here. Let's go ahead and get yourself a T4 screwdriver. So here is the T4 screwdriver. So once you have the T4, which is torque 4 size of that screwdriver, remove the two screws. Get the metal plate and lift the cable straight up and here is your speaker again you just need to lift it straight up if you're not 100 percent sure by pulling the cable if not a good idea get yourself a plastic prying tool you just want to leverage the um the connector and lift it straight up okay and there you go that is the cable on that side T4 screwdriver again, remove the two screws. Oh, sorry, three screws. The screws are not in the same size, so make sure you do not mix match the screw. And once you have removed all the three screws, here comes your entire speaker. Okay, sometimes you can clean it off and the speaker will be okay. Sometimes you would have to change out the whole thing. So what happened is that the speaker here on the side, sometimes it cracked. And once it cracked, you would have this muffled sound to that. Or sometimes it could be dirt or stuff gets stuck underneath that plastic cover. And you get the muffled noise on that. Okay, so let's 
put the broken speaker here on the side. And now let's work on the other right side speaker, T4 screwdriver. Remove the screw. Again, there are three screws in total. And get yourself a plastic prying tool. And we need to pry open this connector right here. Once you pry it up, and you can just remove the speaker. Okay. Trying to get the screw screw out. Here you go. Same thing. That is the right side of the speaker or the left. And I guess this plastic is broken. And I can hear that muffle by pressing at it. All right, let's put that on the side here. We do not need the broken speaker. Here I have the brand new speaker. I hope this is the right uh, model for this speaker. It says MacBook Pro 13 inch, good speaker. So let's find out. I bought this for quite some time ago. I haven't got a chance to use it. So I found that speaker is, is in the in the cabinet and I'll just hopefully I can use it all right so here comes the speaker looks good to me scrape some of the dirt out okay all right let's go ahead and connect them together and I can test it out after so let's connect the speaker make sure you tuck underneath that cable underneath this metal bracket tuck underneath them connect the speaker head just by pressing it down they are like lego put the screws back in once you have that installed now work on the other speaker Get it in. Press it down. Press the cable down. Make sure you have the screws. I dropped a tiny screw here. I need to bring it back up. Okay. Got the metal bracket back in and the two screws. Make sure you connect the battery connector back. There you have it. Put the back plate together. Make sure you have all the screws back in. And once you have all the screws in, you can go ahead and turn on the computer and play your music or any video. And you can try to test the speaker. To test the speaker, I recommend you to go into System Preferences under Sound and you want to toggle that speaker to your left and to your right. So in the balance position, you can move that music or the sound towards to the left of the speaker or towards to the right of the speaker. Then you can identify which of that speaker has the problem or if we have fixed both of the speakers yeah all right so i think this is pretty much it i just walk you through from start to finish and how to replace macbook pro 13 a1502 
left and right speaker together. Hey, if you find the video is helpful, please give me a like and feel free to subscribe to the channel and do not forget to hit the notification bell. That way it really helps me to motivate myself and make more of these computer repair videos for you. And again, if you have any question, comment below. I do read your comments and I'll try to answer any of your computer problems. Thanks again. Smash the like button. Until next time. Take care.